around like Kobe boy The song point like CP3 Probably in my own world My own world just leave me be I don't know what they judge me But they don't even know my name But one day they gon' see my name in the Hall of Fame Ballin' out like Kobe boy That song point like CP3 Ballin' out like Kobe boy That song point like CP3 Coming for y'all Stay focused man Stay focused man Every game is to watch out. I know you all are probably wondering, who is this kid talking all this cash? Meet John Haywing, Kristen Wilson. Kristen transferred from Cleveland John F. Kennedy and has helped his team compete for a top spot in the Senate League. Wilson's been called Debo since he was younger. I can see why. This week, Debo takes on his best friend, Glenville star, Jermon Ivy. Ivy and Wilson played AAU together this summer and attended a lot of camps together this past fall. They push each other to be great and support each other to the fullest. Krista has been waiting for this matchup against Jermon all season. Now it's finally here. Saying me matching up with Jamal, that's probably the best matchup in Northeast Valley basketball to me. You know I'm saying me and we've been going at it since my freshman year. You know I'm saying going in the court, that's my brother, man. We're not hard feelings. It's his business. We got a good job going. This, this is probably the biggest game of the season. Probably the biggest game of the year. This right here determines if we make the playoffs or not. So I'm just about to go ahead and give him my all. Jamon would be the first to strike early. But Debo showed extreme aggressiveness to set the tone for this matchup. Glenville was hot in the first quarter and the beginning of the second, but Hay continued to chip away at the lead, limiting the Ville to just seven points in the second. Jemine started off the third quarter hot.
John Hay is known for their zone defense, but Coach Sanders decided to put a box of one on Ivy to slow him down. Hay gained some momentum and only trailed by one going into the fourth. Crunch time. The Hornets are down by one with just a few seconds to go. So they put the ball in Wilson's hands. Bill took the W. Jermaine and Debo didn't disappoint, finishing with 22 and 21 points respectively. Party, so, like, the phone party, wasn't it? Yeah. 
it was me, it was me and my dudes, and it was him and some Glenville dudes. Like we was all trying to get the same girl. <laughs> And like it kind of worked out because she wanted like everybody. Yeah, know? she did though. And I seen this though, I'm like man, it's the same dude at another party. Yeah, then we played each other like we played each other, and I remember you mentioned on Twitter like I can't wait to go at you and all that. And it was after I played you. And after that, it's just been like, well, from our league first, I respect Jamon of course because you know I'm saying it's my son. I'm a choice. But uh, KT, you know what I'm saying? He's so humble. We get buckets. You know what I'm saying? That's that. Uh, as far as like the other schools, um, I respect. I respect Amari Spellman. Man. He a young dude though. He carrying his team. He getting buckets. Whatever. He still got room to grow and learn and stuff. Ain't too many cats I respect out here though. <laughs> they talk too much. Cause he's better than them, bro. That's, that's all. That's all it is. Like they getting they getting a lot of like exposure. For doing nothing. It's the school they go to, but yeah, they we just get noticed for the name. Bro, we make the name for our school. They get, they, you know what I'm saying? They get noticed because the school they go to. Right. I respect the dudes that's coming from nothing, that's carrying a team. I don't respect these dudes that got the name. Next time on Neo Hoops, Lorraine High Guard Devon Andrews makes his return to the hardwood. I thought that it would be a better team over there. Then I came back because. Uh, I grew up with these people that I'm playing with today. Like, uh, we've been friends since the eighth grade, and I feel like I let my city down, so I came back.